Yo, what up, guys? We're back here for another episode of X Men Evolution. Today we got season one, episode six, Middleverse. Last episode we had, you know, Spike and whatever Speaky. You know, we got Quicksilver and Spike. Uh, Spike, I know less well known. He's the nephew of Auntie O, which is Storm. You know, pretty good. You know, I I didn't really know him that much. I don't even know who he is. Uh, I didn't think he, he's usually not in the X Men. You know, the X Men is usually you know. Cyclops, Jean, Storm, Wolverine, Nightcrawler, Rogue, you know, those guys. But, you know, if they add somebody else, we don't really know. I'm glad he gave him some spotlight. Uh, Spike and Quicksilver have a rivalry, so I bet that's going to go on through the whatever seasons. Kind of an unfair matchup. I feel like Quicksilver and Nightcrawler are probably a better matchup. But let's get into this. Thank you guys for the video. Really do appreciate it. Make sure you can subscribe to me out. Let's go. You going to finish that mood juice? You can have mine. Come on, it might be fun. Matthews is a jerk. No, he's not. I'd go. No freshman allowed. Oh, Matthews is a jerk. Chicks dig the fuzzy dude, right? I'm like so out of here. Later. Hey, that's your brother. Oh yeah, she can't resist. I'm. I mean, like they like they're kind of like family when they go to school. Come on, Scott. What's wrong with a little socializing? I'm sorry, but I just don't think it's a good idea. Dude, it's just a party. I'm with Scott. Day party. Hey, watch the tail. How does tail come out if he's in camouflage? You pulled my tail, man. Grow up, Kurt. Hey, lighten up, dude. You're always goofing around, and you're seriously. He's a kid. Listen. No, you listen. There's a sound I want you to hear, and it's. <coughs> bah, that's different. That is different. <laughs> Wait, yeah, man. you broke it. <laughs> All you had to do was teleport like two steps away or something. You got 10 seconds before this lab self destructs. Have a nice day. What's left of it? Why would you build this at a school? Sir? I don't, I hope you didn't have a good life. It's as simple as that. You know, you build a bomb at a school? Like, what happens to the custodian? He walks in there and he's like, oh, let me clean this place up. And then he sees that and it's like, you got 10 seconds late. Yes. Hey. Okay, it wasn't that big of an explosion. Whatever this stuff was, it's thrashed now. What are you doing here? <laughs> Look who's talking. At least I didn't blow the place up. Okay. Come on now. Back off, blue boy. Okay. Maybe he used his powers. We don't know yet. What happened? Where am I? The Twilight Zone? Is that a thing? Are you confirming that's a thing? Hey. Out of the way! Oh, oh my lunch. What's your lunch? If I see one drop of slime on my new car, it's detention for life. Are we clear? For life? Be careful trying to break it. Why are you throwing it in the trash? Shouldn't you just left it down there? Oh, what's the matter? Little Rogue get into some trouble. Trouble? No. There's just one less X-Men to push us around. Jeez, what is this? Abuse the toad day? Why'd you leave it there? You know yeah, you know he's gonna use it. Not there? No. You'd better contact him. Tell him to knock it off. Scott, I can't pick up a trace of Kurt anywhere. Maybe he's between dimensions. Or somebody did something to him. What are you looking at, Summers? Where's Kurt? I would have to, I just blasted him as soon as I saw him. Scott, no! Hey! I said, Damn. where is he? Get off of me! What have you done with Kurt? Get lost, Slim. Oh, this guys, guys. There's normal kids here. What is going on here? Quiet. You two in my office now. You mean you four? Way too freaky. Ah, it's raining furniture. <laughs> see the desk? Don't see the desk. Why'd you put on your costume? With the school board, I am going to get. What? Huh? What? What happened here? Who took my furniture? 
This man told his petty. <laughs> and look me up, there it goes. You know what happened to Kurt? <laughs> Whoa! Where'd you come from? Hey, I know you. You're the one I saw on the computer screen just before it blew. Uh, yeah. The name's Forge. So you. Wait, Forge? This is Forge? There are some fringe benefits. Trippy. I thought I was the only one. Aww. There he goes. Yeah, everybody just do on their their outfits. Yeah. Man, somebody's really giving that gizmo of yours a workout. Get him! How can she go into the earth and then come back out? How does she not just fall through it? No way back. Not without help from the other side. And I'm thinking that you may be able to help out on that. And man, I'm telling you, I'm ready to go home. Oh, oh, home? It's been like 30 years, buddy. You can tell somebody how to reset the projector to get us back. Oh, I just hope they don't think I'm joking. I kind of have that rep. Ah, <laughs> uh, they'll believe you. That's it, I'm out of here. Ah! I was about to say, we're just gonna let him go. Now, tell us what you did to Kurt. I didn't do anything. He didn't. I did. If you all want to find the boy, you better let him go. If you've hurt him, I'm gonna. You start threatening me, and you're never gonna find your friend. Whoa. She's acting like she knows what she's doing. Can you believe it? He uses CPM. I mean, talk about retro, man. You know what that is? Bring out some kind of like steady, low power pulse wave that just seems to disappear. Oh, these guys are these guys are geniuses. <laughs> okay, so let's trash this thing. Oh. No, no, they've got it all wrong. If they destroy the projector, we'll be trapped here forever. Man, maybe you should have put like some schematics on the internet or something. Oh, there's no internet. <laughs> You know, I could just like phase through the gizmo and like quietly short it out. I mean, that's not as cool though. <laughs> right. Forget I mentioned it. Like, what is it with guys and explosions anyway? Hey, come on, man. Let us have our moment. I think it'll make you visible for a second, but I was so rushed putting it together. Just tell me what to do. Reset. Don't. <laughs> you guys saw that, right? He said, "Reset, don't. You know, don't reset it." Oh my God! I knew they're gonna. I knew they were gonna interpret it like that. These guys are idiots. A warning from the goof man himself? Nah, come on, shred that sucker. <laughs> man, you do have a rep. If you wanted to blow up the projector, why didn't you just say, "Don't reset" instead of "Reset, then don't"? Oh my God, Scott! That's why you're the leader. I don't think that's how it works. We need more juice to get us home. Look! The portal won't last much longer. Come on! What are they doing? Damn, I, I don't know. Well, they only got like two seconds. There they are. And they still got that vape ray I was telling you about. Oh, oh man. We Bro, let you go. Why'd you come back? You got your friends, I got mine. But this ain't my fight. I'm out. Those are your friends? X-Men, keep that portal open. Your call. Guys, you're at school. We're humans. Far out, man. Oh, I swear, that homie's lingo is so whack. No. Nah. <laughs> Gene. This special. Concrete coast. And you like her? Lousy ride, loser. <laughs> Thank you. You sure this will work? No. Wunderbar. Let's hit it. Wunderbar. What does that mean? Time for some serious smashing. Look out! Guys, this party's over. Yeah, we should let them go. You are not old friend, Rogue. And how are you always spying on them? Now that I think about it. Thanks, but 
I better go find my parents. I'm 20 years late for curfew. Thanks for bailing me out. Okay. But if you need I'm any sure help, they don't live there no more. Sure. I'll do that. Hopefully Porsche comes back. Uh, you're going to have to duck until we can get you a new Hollow Watch. <gasps> so it's true. You really are ashamed of me. <laughs> right, dude. <laughs> These guys. My bad. No, it was on me too. As a new man. Your military's going soft. <laughs> yeah. And I could probably dial down the goofing a little. So now what do you say we head home, gear up, and run a level three training sim in the danger room? Jesus. Oh, oh man. This guy. See? That's what I'm talking about. Always serious. Psych. <laughs> you got it. Go with Scott. Yeah, well, tell me about it on the way to Duncan Matthews Park. Well, I can't go, remember? I'm like a freshman. Hey, you're also one of the X-Men. I about to say, I guess you you can't really just show up. Because you, you're going with Gene and Scott. I'm shocked he kicks you out the party. Like, let's be honest here. I'm assuming the guy's in love with Gene. So it's like, you with Gene, it's like, oh yeah, it was cool. It's cool. Don't worry about it. Scott might trash the party though, let's be honest. He might get jealous. You know, there might be heat. There's no way. I don't even know their new names. Avalanche, there's no way Avalanche shows up, right? To that party. A blob. They're, they can't be invited. Because I feel like the X-Men and them are on the same goddamn party. Let's just say that party's not going to survive. All right, somebody's going to bump into somebody. Like, Watch where you're going. Summers. Like, why today? Why today? <laughs> and then somebody's car's going to go flying. And it's not going to look good. And his parents are going to show up. And I'm like, what happened to my house? These guys are already showing that <laughs> it's on site. Anything happened? It's on site. Oh my god. I, I appreciate it. I love action. I love seeing it. I'm shocked. They let Toe go and he's like, hey, they jumped me. <laughs> Let's go running back. <laughs> and I'm like, Bob came. He's like, yeah, y'all yeah, got my boy here messed up. Uh, Mystique. I'm shocked Mystique didn't say anything after hearing about the machine. Oh, so Toe, you said you're the one that sent all my furniture and my brand new car through it. And you just still let him go. <laughs> He's just off the hook? Damn, yo, like he's don't respect you. It's, oh, come on, show some initiative. This show's amazing. This show's great. We got to see Forge. I I know it's going to sound crazy. I only knew about Forge because uh, uh, Marvel Snap, <laughs> the card game on mobile. Uh, this ain't even an ad. Uh, sponsor me, please. That's the only reason I know about it. <laughs> so I absolutely know zero except his name and how he looks a little bit. His powers are technology, like he can make stuff. That's all I really know, or I don't even know if that's true. I'm just assuming maybe that's his power. Thanks for watching. I do appreciate it. Make sure you like and subscribe. I'm going to catch you guys next time for another video. Peace, peace, bye-bye. Have a great day.